what's up it's emma welcome back to my channel i make lifestyle videos for the everyday babe so if you want to stick around and subscribe and ring the bell and follow me on instagram that'd be so cool i think this might be one of my favorite videos to date i have been listening to fine line on repeat like for the past few weeks and i was like oh my god I should dress like Harry Styles and like recreate his iconic looks because he's got the most amazing sense of style. I really look up to him, not only for his like musical talent or whatever, but also his fashion. He's very androgynistic in the way that he dresses. I feel like David Bowie and Prince are huge influences to him. And I say that because my younger sister is a musician and Prince and David Bowie are like two of her biggest fashion icons. And I see a lot of similarities in all of their styles. I loop my sister because I basically shopped through her closet in order to find all of the pieces for this video. So thanks, Kit. You rock. So uh, let's get into it. All right, here is day one, dressing like Harry Styles. I am loving this outfit right now because it's freezing and raining. It's Christmas Eve Eve, and I just wanna be warm and comfortable. I'm getting some work done around the house today. Gonna do some last minute Christmas shopping. I love this outfit. It's just so cozy. It's perfect also because I just did a Soul Cycle class, and if you have colored hair, you understand the struggle of not wanting to wash it more than like twice a week. So happy for this hat. Harry was wearing a black train conductor hat, but I just have this black and green one, so it's fine. I'm wearing a white t-shirt and this brown knit cardigan. Harry was wearing like a crew neck kind of jumper, but this color is so spot on and it gives the same effect. I'm wearing this buckled belt from Zara. These black jeans are from Zara. And then I'm wearing these little Aldo booties. This look is just super comfy and cozy. I just love it. I feel like this is something I would absolutely have worn in high school. Like this exact outfit was my style back then. Yeah, I'll check in with you guys later. We're just gonna like lounge around the house, get some work done, and then go shopping, which is the more exciting part of the day. Merry Christmas Eve. I am wearing a pink suit today. Day two of dressing like Harry Styles. I am feeling myself like nobody's business. Is it the suit? Is it because Santa's coming tonight? I don't know, we're just gonna find out. Um, Love this suit. It's my sister's, it's from Zara. It's a little baggy, so I was originally gonna wear like an oversized white t-shirt, but I decided to go with this little tighter tank top from Brandy because I thought it would add a little bit more shape because it is just like slightly bulky. And um, yeah, I feel like a very chic Santa Claus. Although Santa doesn't wear pink, he should probably reconsider because this is a look. Yeah, it's just so freaking cute. And then I did um, some fake lashes today. I washed my hair on like yesterday. Um, I need to trim my bangs. I really do feel like a rock star. Merry Christmas and welcome to day three, dressing like Harry Styles. This is my Christmas Eve look. It's a navy blue suit. And then I'm wearing these white boots and this same little tank top from Brandy Melville. And then my sister Kat got me this diamond, diamond belt to wear with it. So this is what we're wearing today. Got my hair half up, a few necklaces, and then I've been wearing like all these rings all week. And I have more on this side. And we're gonna go like, I think we're gonna go walk around just a little bit. We're gonna see Little Women tonight, which I already saw with one of my best friends. And I loved it so much that I'm making everyone go see it tonight. And if you haven't watched it yet, this is your sign. Anyway, um, that was irrelevant. Here's my look. Now it's a portion of the video where we take outfit photos on the beach. Normal things. Okay, we just took like so many photos. So if you guys don't go follow me on Instagram right now. No, I'm kidding, but not really. Good morning, guys. It is day four of dressing like Harry Styles. I'm back in LA just to do some work for the day. I don't know if we're staying here tonight or going back to Newport, but this is the outfit. I feel like a zookeeper slash Lewis from Even Stevens. And this is the first outfit all week that I've just felt really weird in. I just feel like it doesn't have a lot of shape and it's just kind of like super 
90s dad, which normally I go for, but I don't know. I feel like today is just, I didn't want to dress like this. But anyway, just wearing a white t-shirt, this kind of like faux suede type yellow jacket that used to be my grandma's. And then I'm wearing these khaki pants from Topshop and my chunky dad shoes. Just very like big and light and airy and it's very cold today. So not feeling super cuddly, Um, but this is the look. Just gonna get some work done today, run some errands. Yeah, not feeling super confident in this one, but it's okay. All right guys, it's the fifth and final day of dressing like Harry Styles. I'm wearing an outfit that's inspired by the Fine Line album cover, which I'm going to try to recreate today. We'll see how that goes. I'll film the process, don't you worry. So I don't have a blouse that's exactly the same color as Harry's. I'm gonna do a little Photoshop magic for the photo and see like if we can make it the same color. But I love the idea of wearing chiffon and chiffon pants. I don't think these are real chiffon, but it's like similar. But this blouse, fun fact, this blouse belonged to my mom in the 80s. And if you close it, there's like this little keyhole, which is really cool. And my sister said she wanted to have it for her closet because it reminds her of Prince, which is definitely, I feel like, a huge inspiration for Harry's outfits. Like, he wears a bunch of stuff like this, so I wonder if Prince is one of his, like, inspirations. But I love that look. I'm not gonna wear it like that right now, though, because I'm too hot. And then I'm wearing these white pants from Zara. They do have stripes down the side. It's as good as it's gonna get. I didn't really wanna like buy a pair of white pants if I already own a pair. And then I'm just wearing my chunky sneakers. So yeah, I love this look. I still have to do my makeup and stuff, but I wanted to show you guys the last outfit right now. So we are at a very busy mall and we're gonna try to get, sorry, I'm fixing my hair. We're gonna try to get the thumbnail photo. Oh yeah, that's Ooh, oh, that's good. <laughs> I'm realizing that I should have worn my um, black booties. Are you sure you don't want to switch for just a picture? Oh yeah, let's switch. Okay, we're switching shoes. Yeah. We're gonna try this again, but right here, so that when we're like photoshopping, there's no weird lines or sun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I like that one. Yay! Okay, I think we got it. What did you guys think? Which outfit was your favorite? Comment down below. That was so much fun. I definitely stepped out of my comfort zone and it was really cool to wear all these bright colors and textures and so many people like complimented the outfits that I was wearing and it just seemed normal. Like it didn't seem like I was wearing anything out of the ordinary and I think that's what's so cool about doing these videos is just opening your eyes a little bit more and seeing what other options and styles are out there that you may not have considered wearing before before or were too afraid or whatever the list can go on I just really enjoyed putting myself out of my comfort zone a little bit and wearing more color because <laughs> I wear neutrals like all the time if you have any other celebrities or youtubers that you want to see me dress like eat like etc leave them in the comments I really love this video and I hope you guys did too and um wow 2020 right around the corner so so excited for all the content that is coming thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.